Francisco 49ers officially signed Marlon Mack. He was cut by the Houston Texans this offseason. He was released by the, the, well, he wasn't released, but he was let go by the Indianapolis Colts. Colts didn't want him. Texans signed him, expecting him to maybe be something on the roster. Just didn't work out. Damian Pierce found some, and he ran with it. Marlon Mack was cut, and now Marlon Mack finds his third home over in San Francisco on the other side of the coast. And what a place for him, man. I really hope he gets a chance to shine again. I really hope he gets a chance to show who he really is again. He was phenomenal with Indy. When he was healthy, he was a lead back. He was phenomenal. We just had a chance to go out and get a better back, a generational back that had a much higher upside. And you know how it is paying backs nowadays, you know, paying them good money. It's a little weary for NFL clubs because of injuries, because, you know, their expectancy isn't very long. You know, they once they hit 27, they have an injury or two. It's, it, it, it gets scary after that. But, yeah, I hope Marlon Mack plays well. The interior offensive line of the 49ers isn't great. Tackles, beautiful. Tackles are pretty good. Interior needs to get better, I think. But Marlon Mack, he, you know, what better place than to go than a place where running backs always find a way to have phenomenal games, a phenomenal season. I hope Marlon Mack gets it figured out. I hope he gets the chance he deserves, and I hope Marlon Mack proves a lot of people wrong over there. Go Mack. Mack attack is in San Fran. Good luck, Mack. This is JW Sports Talk Show signing off.